Hi and welcome to the next tutorial. Today we're going to be looking at how to create this simple mirror effect using After Effects and some stock footage. First thing we need to do is we need to open up After Effects and we need to import our files into our project area. So to do this we can just drag and drop. And now that our file is in here we can just drag it to our timeline. And now this will create the composition from the resolution of the stock footage. So to do this, it's quite simple. All you need to search up is the mirror effect in effects and presets. And you need to drag it onto your stock footage. So you have some options here. You have the reflection center and you also have the reflection angle. If you play around with some of these settings, you can get some really unique effects. So if we divide the resolution by two, now we've created a mirror, an equal mirror on the opposite side. Also, if we change the reflection angle to 90 degrees, we can get another kind of mirrored effect, but this time it's in one small section of the actual stock footage. So to get both effects at the same time, what you need to do is you need to drag out another mirror on there and then do the same process again. So divide by two and that will give us, and that's all we have to do in After Effects. Now we're going to take this uh, footage to Adobe uh, Premiere Rush and we're going to add some uh, titles on there. So to export this, we don't need all of this section. So I'm just gonna cut back a little bit and I'm just going to export that. Now to export, you need to go to composition, add to media encoder Q, and make sure that you um, choose a spot on your computer and make sure you render it. So this is what um, Adobe Media Encoder looks like. And what we have to make sure is we have to make sure we're using the H.264 codec, which will give us an MP4 file. If you want to change your path or where you are going to save your project just click here and then you can save it to wherever you like then once you're ready you can press the little plus icon to actually um, render your video so now we're in Adobe Premiere Rush and what we are going to be doing is we are going to be creating a new project now you need to select your files once you get into new project and just find the actual video that was exported from Adobe After Effects and I've also added some music in here as well. So I've got a music file and I've got my uh, video file as well. When I'm ready to create, all I need to do is just press create and it will join, um, it will prepare the media so that we can start to add some titles to our little video. So you can see how this is my audio track and we obviously don't need it for that long so we're gonna cut that back. All we are going to be doing is we're going to be adding some titles to our screen over here. Now there are a lot of titles that you can choose from. So all I'm going to do is just click and drag and it will now appear on my timeline. And now I can just make that a little bit longer and I'm going to edit the text. So I'm going to call it mirror effect and if I want to change the font I can I can do it all in here so I'm gonna pick that font if I want to change the size of the font I can do that there I can add some shadow I can add some outline if I like and all your options are in there. If you want to change, you know, that line, that color, I can also do that in my properties. And so when I'm ready to export that, all I need to do is go to share and then that will create that small little video with our little audio that we can use for YouTube or for whatever. So anyways, guys, I hope you learned something. Thanks for